All right, so today, um, I did kind of plan on playing a different team, but I really like Dr. Doom, so I'm going to bring him back so you guys can get a second helping of Dr. Doom. A lot of the teams I'm facing now are still pretty annoying. It's, it's mainly reverted back to what it was originally, so I'm fighting a whole bunch of um, Enchantress. But this match, oddly enough, is not Enchantress. Wow. Well, now that he's nearly dead... Uh, what next? So let's... I'm really not sure what to do now. She would be protected. Well, this is a loss, because this is now impossible. Actually, it might not be. Okay, so Quicksilver can't touch me. So, at this point, I've already been reduced to having to kill everybody else in the team. So. Okay, so my survival training is going to hold me together really well right here. Oh my goodness. Okay, this is only going to heal. So I'm going to heal here, so I can get back above um, a good amount of health. Can't neutralize me. This ought to kill Quicksilver on the second one. Please crit him. Oh, and you just give him an extra turn. Whew. Well, we all thought that was a loss. Turns out that new EISO is broken. Surprise. That was so lame. I almost died. Like, Doom didn't even get to play. Like, it was just, hey, you get Ring Imperial and then you die. That's not fun. Okay, here we go. This is more fair. They must have a uh, mystic, yeah. So I would like to. What's this apply? Pump. Okay, so. I do want to still hit her. There we go. Alright, so she's been damaged to pieces. No, I definitely need to kill her because I don't want to be debuffed for this in the fight. That makes sense. It's 
survival train is really pulling through there. Okay, so now... Can you lock out his tech? Yes, you can. Oh, he's pretty much done. that put on there? Oh, thorns. Okay. Well, he's out of actions. And now that she's dead, I don't have to worry about um, losing my turns. I don't have to worry about null at all. So this is pretty much already a win. This is the problem. I rarely ever get Doom's countdown to ever actually go completely down. For some reason, that made no sound. But I think he's probably more important to kill. I'm not worried about Nell because I'm just going to absorb him every time he swings. Do some healing. You know, I should have did this first. Excuse me. Whatever. Okay, so... Because that made zero sense. I don't know why it just didn't do anything. As far as I know, that skill can't miss. My Doom can't be exhausted, so... I do have heal on, on magic, right? Yeah. Oh. So... I was messing around with other characters earlier, and I messed around with Guardians of the Galaxy, Drax, and Star-Lord, because I've never really seen them picked. I think I see why. Just the way the game is currently doesn't allow that to work. Like. So, okay, so let's say you fight your normal team, which is Enchantress Pestilence. Like, they're going to blow up. And that's just the sad story that you have to deal with. They're really just going to blow up. Like, you can't bleed them out very well. Because I don't know if you guys are aware of what Drax's Guardian of the Galaxy passive is, but every Guardians of the Galaxy member, their attack supply bleeds and hemorrhage. Which sounds amazing, and it is against like Quick Lord, but as soon as you get Enchantress Pestilence, it's like, okay, well, all your bleeds are half damaged, and you're probably going to swing your teammate. And then you're just kind of ruined after that point. I mean, there's really nothing you can do. It's really sad. Like, they could have just simply done something, like... Well, I don't know. The whole problem is Beast is just too much of a pain for anybody to deal with. And along with Enchantress, who just shuts down your ability to move, it's, it's still rather helpless. Like, she was, I believe, nerfed. I have to double check. But it doesn't seem to make that much of a difference. Like, I updated my tier list, and I think I might move her back up, but not Quicksilver, because the Elite EISO really, really hurts Quicksilver. 
definitely the the most negatively affected character by that. He, he would dodge. As, as you saw in that last match, like, my agent pretty much absorbed him to death. He didn't even really have to swing. Which is insane. And honestly, him swinging at me is really what carried me through the match. And because everyone who has it should be using it. I mean, I don't see why you wouldn't put that on. It's just silly. Like, everybody who's using it should should be beating Quicksilver at this point pretty easily. Especially if you also have Hoogan's Eye. Like, that's just a wrap. Like, any unarmed character not only is immune to you, but they kill themselves to you. So that, that's hopeless now for them. Yeah, I put Thorns on him instead of Stealthy, because one of his skills, the uh, Essence Steel thing, that's already Stealthy. So I was like, eh... You know, that's good enough. I also have him apply obsolete tech, which you haven't really seen me use against the agent. Which I guess I probably should start doing. But, I mean, I just really hate Ruth, so I was just like, I just want to hit her. But, I mean, obsolete... It's not obsolete tech, it's downgrade, though the better version. I don't remember if he's tech or not, but I, I don't think he does. Oh, absorbed. Absorbed. Can I, can I play? No, because he's gonna shoot me. I, I don't even know what to do. That was so corny. Holy shit. Okay, so he's got a black Roscoe. So I... Rather hit the case. If there's anything stealthy, he'll shoot me. Uh, I'll probably die. Oh, please. Maybe they hit their follow-up limit. I don't know. All in one turn. Oh, my tech is obsolete. The agent really needs to die. Um, he doesn't have any magic, I don't think. So Hex and Jaeger probably wouldn't be the best thing to do. You just gotta hope this actually hits him. Okay, that hit. struggling right now. Targeted. Nimble. Yeah, I'm dead. That, this is impossible now. Yeah. 
Uh, that first turn was so stupid. That's why Dr. Doom needs more health. Because, once again, I'm going to point out that he has the same health as my agent. For a guy that's taking up two character slots. Now, sure, he takes a lot of turns. I'll give you that. But he should have more than 900 health over my agent. That's insane. And that wasn't what was intended, but that's what it eventually turned into just over the course of the game. Unfortunately, that's just kind of what happened. Because, like, his bonus was somewhat visible when he was first released, but they got to keep in mind the game changed. Like, the bonuses changed. And when the bonuses changed, his didn't adjust correctly. And they were never adjusted correctly, honestly. Because it's... It really helped out Nico the way it was set up, and it really hurt Doom and Kang, and they just don't seem to care. Which is confusing to me. And he has a really old scrapper out. You don't see anybody using that. I don't even think I own that. I think at that point I wasn't winning PvP. Yeah, we're gonna turn the tech off. Like, this is, should be an easy match. I think he's unarmed, so I don't think he can touch me. Yeah, he has that too. Okay. Let's see what we're working with. So, I'm just gonna do this, because I know I can't hit around him anyway. I just want to absorb everybody else a whole bunch. Hijack him once. Really? Like, that set was... It seemed so cool on paper, and then I tried it, and I was like, eh... I'm not... not really impressed. <laughs> I don't think anybody really used that set after they got it. I think like I've gotten every set that's come out pretty much recently. Like I think almost uh, the ones after the Superior Soldier set, I think it is. I got those ones. And that set was pretty garbage. It's only good if you just don't like being opportunity debuffed like really bad. And honestly, it doesn't bother me to the point where I'm just going to equip a crappy set. Don't want to swing at my teammate. Yeah, they pretty much lost. I think he's Infiltrator now. Yeah. That was like the cool part of the set. It, it, as cool as that was, it was just like, eh. It's not enough to really... No. It's not enough to make it win. That was just kind of like a cool gimmick put on a kind of mediocre set. But, like, now they've made sets that are, are good. Two strong ones in a row. Okay, we're just gonna do another one, because I, I don't like just having... Oh! Okay, here we go, here we go. Because I've, I've wanted them to be in the training, so there we go. Yes, game. He's training. We know this. I don't know. It, whatever. I mean, that's something they just refuse to fix. It's not a game-breaking issue. It's just silly and stupid. We can deal with silly and stupid. All right. Now, I've got to hope to not blow up to this stupid crap. Okay. 
it. Drill. And he avoided a ground attack. You guys are seeing this, right? Because those aren't really supposed to be avoided. You have a weather control device, so we're just going to turn that off. It's probably the last thing he has to hit me with. And lower his damage a bit. Yeah, so this was working pretty well. I mean, I lost one match due to stupid follow-ups. I mean, everybody, every team damn near would lose to that. I mean, there's really nothing you can do when they just start following up. Unless you just loaded with Combo Breaker. You know. And I don't always feel like running Combo Breaker. Because, you know, we have five slots now. And sometimes you still get in that scenario where it's like, I wish I had another slot. But, I mean, that's just being greedy at that point, but... I don't know. Oh, you're gone. Yeah, I mean... I don't think these guys have a lot of stats, but I've also, like, nerfed all their damage, so... This wasn't even remotely challenging. I feel like Star-Lord isn't, like, as high as I had him in my tier list earlier. At the moment. I don't know. I have him in A tier instead of S. I mean, he's still really good. He's just not on that kind of OP level, I guess. He never really was, honestly. He was just like an annoying Quicksilver partner. And because of Quicksilver dropping because of that EI... Oh, so close. Because of that EI, so he kind of drops too. Because I just have Quicksilver S. Regular S. Because he's still strong on offense. He's just a little bit more risky on defense. Because they're just too dumb to get around agents. But that's pretty much it for today. That's not too bad. One five out of six. Yeah. For messing around with different characters and teams. You, know, you can't expect too much more than that. But, uh... I'll try to come up with something interesting to play. I wanted to do something with uh, uh, Emma Frost. And then I was told by somebody else to pick Thane, and I was just like, oh, I don't like Thane. I can't come up with anything with Thane. But I'll try to come up with a Thane team, if, if that's even remotely possible or a thing. So we'll just have to see. But uh, I'll... Won't be recording until next week, so I will see you probably Monday. Uh, good luck, I guess, in your preseason. Not that it really matters that much.